All right, now Raven has her own show. That's called That's So Raven. She is also an accomplished singer with a couple of albums to her own and also a song on Disney Mania, too. Joining us live via satellite is Raven. Hey, good morning. Good hey, morning. Good morning. Oh, thank you. Woo. I get the applause. Hey. How are you doing? I'm doing well, and you? Uh, we are huge fans of your show. Every day uh, in the Allen household, we have That's So Raven on the air, and uh, congratulations on the success of it. Oh, thank you very much. I'm glad you guys are watching. Having grown up in the business, do you ever have time just to be a, a normal young person, or are you always an industry young person? I, I was born into the industry. Uh, this is normal for me. Um, I've, I've been to public school, and I've done that, and that's odd to me. I'm there, and I'm trying to fit in. But yeah, right. in this industry, this is normal to me. This is where I'm supposed to be. What kind of creative input do you have with that show? Because it seems pretty organic. It seems like the person we see in that show is not a far cry from who you are. Uh, she's, a lot, she's a lot more hyper than I am, actually. Um, she's a little bit hyper, just a little bit compared to me. Um, you know, the people on the show, the writers and the producers, they trust um, us to, uh, you know, put our own little touches on certain things. They know that since we're teenagers and we have to play the character, that we're going to, you know, treat right. it right and, you know, do the, do the best that we can. So we get a little bit and we, we get a lot, depending on what it is. And if you look at the people that have come out of this, it's sort of uh, d the Disney generation that are largely behind uh, That's So Raven, look at your Lizzie McGuire turning Hillary Duff into a big star. If you go way back in the day, Justin Timberlake, all of these people came out of this environment, and they're treating you good too, I guess, huh? Disney has a wonderful synergy. They help you with everything. If you want to be, you know, in the spotlight and famous, definitely Disney's the place to go. <laughs> what kind of stuff's in this new CD that's coming up? Um, Disney Mania 2 is a fabulous CD with a lot of different... Um, Disney stars that you know and, you know, um, singing stars as well, singing songs from Disney movies that you know and uh, putting our own little twist on it. And I'm singing True to Your Heart, sung by 98 Degrees and Stevie Wonder from the Mulan soundtrack. Oh, very nice. And so I, I love the stuff that you guys do from Lion King. And uh, what other Disney movies are represented? Um, there's a lot of different Disney movies represented. Actually, I only have one song on the CD, but I, res I did some songs for other Disney Channel not Disney Channel, but Disney movies, like Lion King One and a Half, Lion King Special Edition DVD, Superstition, um, but there's a lot of other on the CD as well. We can't let you go without asking about your old uh, Cosby mates. you ever keep in touch with uh, anybody on the show and you run into them from time to time? I'll run into them from time to time, but um, we're all very busy. It's hard to get together and talk, but I'll see them every once in a while. Okay, I gotta ask you about this. Uh, you were on a game show recently. Do you remember which game show you were on, the celebrity edition of what? <laughs> Do we have to talk about that? <laughs> I was <laughs> I was on the celebrity edition of um, I don't I don't remember. <laughs> Come on, we saw it. Yeah, I know. I forgot. I blocked it out of my memory. I was so scared. I forgot what it's called though. Oh, what? the weakest link. Right, you're on the weakest link, and we're the weakest link station. And sorry, I had to bring this up because on that, uh, and you know what? We learn from our mistakes. Am I right, everybody? Yeah. Right. We all make yeah, mistakes, right? On this show. That's what yeah. I'm saying. So I want you to prove that you've learned from your mistake. What does PO mean uh, in post office box? <laughs> you just gave me the answer. You just said you gave the answer. Right. Post office box. My I teacher got on my butt about those questions. She was like, I can't believe you. <laughs> well, since it's, ah, when you get in the the, the most obvious question and questions and the most obvious answers c sometimes can be the most difficult because you're thinking of so many things at the same time. Right, exactly, right. and I was and I had the question about the beehive before, and I was surprised that I got that answer. So I was, you know, my mind was boggled. Right, right, right. Uh, hey, listen, you know, it's like, it's one of those things where you just you, you have those brain cramps every once in a while. We all get them. It's why it's why we're not building rockets. Right, you, right, you could put Einstein on one of those shows on the weakest link right. and get him under the bright lights in the right. studio audience and the host that's trying to be funny. Einstein would fail. So I remember, just, I remember, I was signing some things for a couple of fans and this guy came up to me and brought me a calculator and a and a toy and I was like, what is this for? He was like, so you know the answers to the questions for the weakest link oh, from Captain wow. America. I was like, oh, I'm sorry. It was so That's when you get security to pounce on them. <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs> I kept it. Congratulations on all your success. And go back on Weakest Link. I think you're going to do better next time. Thank you very much. Now I Thanks feel better. Us. Thank you. Thanks for spending some time. That's wow. Raven. That's so Raven. A couple new albums on the way. Disney Mania 2 is on the way. And also the soundtrack wow. to that.